Hello, fellow Earth Keepers. It's great to be here with you again. And many of us over the years, and this may be familiar to you, we ask ourselves, well, what is our purpose? And everybody on this planet either are going to be asking that question, are asking that question, or have asked that question. What is my purpose? And I want to just put that aside for a moment by saying, according to the Course in Miracles that I've been a long student of, it's simple. We don't need to make something that's simple overly complex because when we ask that question, what is our purpose? We begin this journey of endless seeking because there's no end point or realization about that. Bear with me for one minute. Why do I say that? Because we all have the same purpose and it's simple. And that purpose is to return, to remember our most authentic, truest, heart-centered, soul-centered, mind-centered self. A lot of folks call that our authentic being. So simply, the journey of purpose is just a natural unfolding of our own vision quest. As they would say in the shamanic realm, we take this great quest to find our purpose. So hopefully that helps to align you just to a one single bullseye of authenticity within yourself. Why do I share that with you today? Because I believe there's a, another important question to ask ourselves. And that question is what shamans and earth keepers ask themselves. What is my medicine? What is it that I am here to come, to share, to serve, to help others, to become their fullest version and most indelible version of themselves? That fully potentiated soul and heart that we all are. And shamans carry their medicine pouch. The me like a medicine man or a doctor used to make house calls carries his medicine pouch. And within that pouch, we carry our medicine. And that medicine on an inward basis is the quinescence the quinescence of our lifetime of knowledge, experience, and wisdom. And when we bring together our journey in that way of gathering that knowledge, that experience, and that wisdom, we are able to realize what our medicine is. Now, the Mayans referred to this quinescence of our collective wisdom and experiences and knowledge as it's. It's the dewdrop of our purest, most light-centered, heart-centered being within ourselves. So what is your medicine and what is medicine? Well, medicine is what we bring. And this is what I want you to really tune into today is we, we bring through through our own personal stories, our traumas, physical or emotional, our addictions, our familiarity as mothers and fathers, as grandfathers and grandmothers, our connection to earth. We bring through the truth of who we are. And in my video, The Gamma Ray Force, I spoke to this truth and this power that emerges when a star becomes too big for itself and in it, it explodes and creates universes and universes. Well, here too are we coming to a place of our maximum capacity at times and we're just stressed out. Life is not well, the planet's seemingly not well. So what do we do? Well, we kind of just implode and explode into our lives and find our way again. So when we come to that place to discover our medicine, we bring forth 
the key nuggets that come through our traumas. And this is how we free ourselves into our greatest potential and where we can serve as earth keepers to serve this beautiful planet we share. So whatever medicine you discover for yourself, I trust and I hold that it will serve you, that it will free you, that it will love you and you in turn will love yourself and share that medicine with the world. Well, that's all for now. Be well, sending many blessings and may your medicine touch many and may the love and light of who you are and the genius of who you are serve the greater good of all. Be well.